Now, I don't think we should ever lead the Fallings, but I'm going to do it this time. I want them to lead Arcanine. I dare you to lead Arcanine to beat my Titar Exodrill, Chief. I dare you. Give me my Adrenal Orb and Defiant proc. Poggers. I'll be able, I'll be able to go for Airstreams. Hmm. And then we just bring Titar Exodrill now. I want to bring Rotom, though. Rotom's really good here, actually. I'm going to bring Rotom and Extra Drill. No T-Tar this time. T-Tar's good here, too. I think T-Tar's actually, like, super good here, but we'll just try to get away with this. That team is super bulky. That team is not ready for the power of Rotom. Team is not ready for the power of Rotom, though. But we'll see. I'd love to see an Arcanine. Fallings. Yes, we're bringing the Fallings. We're busting it out. I don't think it's going to do anything this game. But, I mean, if he leads Arcanine, oh, man. He's going to give us a Defiant proc. He's going to give us an Adrenaline Orb proc. We got Cable VGC. Yo, my guy, thank you for the follow. Awesome. All right, let's see what we're working with here. All right, let's see. Are you going to fall for this Intimidate bait? Give me the double boost. All right. We'll see. What do you guys think they're going to lead with? I hope it's Arcanine. I hope it's like Arcanine Mandibuzz with the potential to switch in like Ferrothorn or something. It's Arcanine Rotom. Oh, we did it. Oh, man. That's so good. Yo. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Intimidate. Thank you. Thank you. Defiance up. And you know what? You know what they say. One good Intimidate deserves another. Proc and our Adrenaline Orb. That's so good. All right. Which one of these Pokemon is more of a threat? Rotom or Arcanine? I think the Rotom is. Sorry, uh, the Arcanine. Oh, I could, I could befuddle and no retreat if I rolled really well. Ah, oh, that'd be so savage. I'm just going to try and one-shot the Rotom, though. And we're going to sleep out of this Arcanine. Because we outspeed it quite a bit right now. Sleep powder, you'll love to see it. Don't you dare one bury me. Alright, both Kamulus. Good thing we're hitting the slower one first. Come on, give me that one shot. Give me that big one shot. Close combat. At, that's a plus one and a life orb. Rotom Wash never heard of it. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> we still haven't Dynamaxed yet. Rotom, Arcanine taking the nice little chill pill. Like, don't make me sleep pot. I'm going to sleep pot the other one with no retreat. I, you know I got to do it. And then we're just going to rock side spam and win the game. Oh, that's so good. Rank Master, what is this? Mandibus? Oh, Sylveon. That's going to bed. All right. You guys ready? No retreat. No retreat. No surrender. Sleep powder's up. That big butterfree. Big butterfree. And then we're going to slam the biggest rock slide into this guy. And go for like airstreams with Butterfree to give our rotes, or give our fallings. Oh, he's going to protect Sylveon. That's really good. If his Arcanine makes up this turn, we might be in a bad spot. But, you know, we're getting our boost off right now. Getting our boost off right now. Arcanine's still asleep. You'll love to see it. No retreat. No surrender. OMG, that's so big. The biggest Pokemon ever. All right, what the hell do I do now? I think you just close combat the Arcanine and put the Sylveon to sleep. I think that is the play. Because Arcanine can wake up this turn. I don't want to miss a Rock Slide. I don't want to miss it yet. He's going to withdraw. Okay, you can go to bed over there. Rank Master is going to send out what? Barathord? Oh, I don't know about that one, Chief. Like, close combat, delete! Yo, I'm not to plus two. I got that Life Orb. I got that close combat. Oh, OMG, that's so much damage. You know I'm about to be close combat in that fair throw in the face. Oh, this is his fault, by the way, for leading Arcanine. How dare you bring Arcanine to activate my Defiant and Adrenaline Orb? How dare you? I'm about to run out of close combats, guys. I only got three more. He's probably going to protect with the fair thorn. I don't even need Dynamax right now, guys. I don't even need it. Battle was canceled. We take those wins. Phalanx. Freaking fantastic. Fantastic Phalanx. Amazing. I can't believe that actually worked. 
I know he's gonna lead Gyarados. So like, let me just think about what I actually. That means I just lead with Phalanx, right? Let's try those. Phalanx, Rotom, and then I think we just T-Tar Exeter, right? From there. Right? Oh, that that extra his extra is Mole Breaker. Let's be real, it's Mole Breaker. Yo, Rotom Freeze! I'm excited to see what it can do. Yo, if you really want to see some good highlights of Rotom Freeze. We're going to try our best to keep making it work. But we've already been streaming for like over an hour. And we have like five or six games of that thing absolutely popping off. So like I would say if you just want to watch this thing succeed, just scroll back to the start of the stream. Yo, is that a another sub from Fletcher Pat 24 Guys, put some subs up for Fletcher. Thank you for that Twitch Prime, my friend. He did lead the Gyarados, which means... Phalanx. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this Phalanx? If you're a good player, you can win with mostly anything as long as your game plan is solid. Both made top 5 with Noctowl and Avalug. I mean, Avalug doesn't suck. Noctowl sucks, but like, I mean, uh, uh, even in like Gen 6, like, I was dumpstering a lot of people for those guys that like remember Gen 6. Uh, or was it, sorry, not Gen 6, in Gen 7 with like Toucanon. I went undefeated in best of 3s on stream for like 6 or 7 months. Still undefeated with Toucanon in best of 3s because it's possible. This is Eeks? Wait. Oh, Eeks is actually a good buddy of mine. I'm one of the reasons why he has like a lot of people in his stream. I, I host him every day. Eeks is like a good friend of mine. We live really close to each other. Yo, then he knows that I'm the meme master. All right, let's just protect and discharge. There's no way he's gonna let me get away with this. He's probably gonna follow me and that's why this is gonna be absolutely amazing. I wanna use on Pheasant, I do too. And I don't think, I don't think Eeks would run this team, so. Follow me, there it is. Yeah, most people find Eeks because of me. I, I've actually done a lot to like help him like get a lot of stuff. Dragon Dance, yeah, Eeks wouldn't do this. Eeks would just win. This is too react, this is like too passive to be Eeks. What's the spread on Phalanx? Uh, this is actually just a full speed attack one. Super simple. Is that an Electric Dewsberry? I still think you're gone, Chief. I still think you're gone. Oh my gosh, he lived that. Well, that sucks. All right, let me think about this though. I think you actually have to click the both of these because he's gonna one shot one of them. Yeah, that's that's unfortunate, but we kind of have to do it. Short time slapping. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, he's going to one-shot one of my Pokemon, and so I have to do it this way because uh, he can still follow me too. So you have to go double AoE. All right. Yeah, I really respect Eeks' hustle. He's been streaming like every day. Like, man's make, man makes good content too. Super happy to help him grow. All right, let's go. Who are you one shot in chief? Are you Max Garden? I'm just going to kill myself. All right, cool. He's not. <laughs> that would have sucked. I thought about Dynamaxing with like the following stick of uh, goer into that. But let's see. Who are you one shot in? Going for the geyser. Really like to see the not airstream as well. Rotom. Bye, Rotom. You, you tried your best. All right, let me just hit this rock slide. I have, a, I have a defiant boost too. So like I got that damage right now. I think I have a defiant boost, right? No! <laughs> what? Are you real? Yo, that's so bad. That's really not great. Um, That sucks. Ah! Ah, that sucks. I'm so sad. Sad, sad. Big sad. Goodbye, Defiant Boost. I have to switch, yeah. I have to switch in T-Tar here to reactivate the sand, which gives me a plus one speed so I can go for a second rock slide. Ah, oh, man, that sucks. All right, can we hit this rock slide then? Yeah, Eeks has really good emotes too. Eeks has some good emotes. My oh, did he take away the? There it is. Eeks cool. Eeks cool. There we go. I don't act like I'm not subbed to my boy. There we go. See, I got I got him too. All right. We got the Gyarados down. We got it. We got it down for the count. And we got the T Tar switching. And we don't. He does not know our scarf yet. Dazzling Gleam. Ow! Breaks my sash, too. That sucks. Alright. 
Yeah, Eeks wouldn't play that way though, so yeah, it's not. We just we're just talking about him. Talking about how amazing he is. He's actually been making a lot of YouTube content too. How many of you guys are subscribed to James Eek's YouTube channel? He's been pumping out that good content now. I think this extra drill, it's Mole Breaker. Awesome. All right, I'm going to, let me just hit my rock slides. If I hit my rock slides, it's not a problem. Oh, is he gonna? Watch this. You guys ready for this? Ooh. Ah, let me hit my rock slides. He's going to follow me. Oh, cancel. Oh, come on. I didn't even get to show my cool stuff. All right. Well, I was going to win anyways. He's going to set the hail for me. He's going to do me a solid. All right. We're going to go with probably extra drill. Rotom. Extra drill, extra drill Rotom is such a good lead. Because I can go for the EQ discharge, uh, I can go for like a Rock Side discharge. I can also switch out Rotom or even Volt switch out Rotom or something like that for my Tyranitar to activate uh, Extra Drill's um, Sand Rush, which is super good. So we got those three. What do we want the last Mon to be? I don't think we need Falling. Falling is actually That's not right. even bad here, guys. That's right. I'm just gonna bring you. What you gonna do, huh? You had six bulk old bottle caps a season. How are the Ivies bad? Because you, I don't have six level hundred Pokemon, and why would I waste the gold bottle cap on like a Pokemon we're just gonna use once? I don't think I've used the gold bottle cap. I don't think I've used. I've used one bottle cap maybe, but like because I stream with a brand new team every single day, you can't just throw. I'd run out of those bottle caps in a week if I used them every day. That's on Weezing. Any tips for using him as an opener? The tip is to not use him in the opener. The tip is to switch him in to turn you up for a power play. That's probably the best way to do it. I don't think you use him as a lead. That's really not the way to do it. It's the best way to use it is to... The, I, the best way to use him as a lead is to lead with him and make it look like you're doing something. So, like, you lead Weezing Arcanine, right? And so, obviously, you're not using your Intimidate. And then switch out your Weezing for another Intimidator and get, like, a double Intimidate. Does, does that make sense? So, take away your own abilities that you're turning off and then activate them at your choosing. That'd be the best way to use him as an opener. Grimson! Oh, he set the hail! Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Do we even want to hail? He's going to go for, like, probably that uh, trick combo play, right? Let's see. I want the hail, though. I want it! I think I'm going to switch out my x girl though. Just for Falling this turn. I think Falling is still a good switch. Uh, I don't want to lose my Sash yet. So, I'm a Blizzard. Blizzard's up, yo! How's it going? Played you about half an hour ago using Goth Braviary. Always a pleasure to play you. I love your team build. So unique. I hate that you go for Blind Hypnosis, but other than that, you played like an absolute champion. Fake out into the... OMG! That's right, yo! Blizzard? Yo, I'm gonna show you a real Blizzard in just a sec, Chief. Followings? I don't even care. Blizzard! so big who's blizzard who wore it best all right no scotty was the guy that was that scotty no i'm pretty sure scotty was the guy that had the uh that had the blind hypnosis goth i think or was scotty the uh was scotty the blind hypnosis guy or was scotty the hydrogun guy yeah wide lens max speed goth all right well if you're wide lens and your plan is to go for that i can't fault you Yeah, this is fine. <laughs> that's fine. If it's max... Like, obviously it was max speed. Like, if that's your intention, I don't fault it as much. So. He's gonna switch out. Yo! This is gonna be so big! The rock slide blizzard? Let me hit it. Yo, you're just gonna eat this rock slide, chief? You're just gonna eat the rock slide? Like an absolute champion. OMG, this big damage. Oh, all right, bro, Tom, give me that double hit. Oh, the double blizzard. I know you got a light screen up, Chief, but like, the double KO. The double. That was so big. And he sent my blizzard back up for me. What a nice guy. 
Yo, thank you so much for the vanilla. Cause, like, I really appreciate you uh, going out of your way to like reset my weather for me. Like, absolute MVP. And oh, and you bring out Pokemon that are like weak to the Blizzard, or not, not weak, but like take neutral damage. All right, so we just gotta play this one. Actually, let me think about how I should play this one, cause like I have that Echo Drill. If I can get the, uh, what is this Pokemon over there? That thing off the board. I think I might be Dynamaxing my T-Tar this turn. Let me think. I need to get the Whimsicott off the board. So if I, if I can Rock Fall. I think it's Scarf. That's like a whole thing. I'm, hmm. Rock Slide and KO, all I gotta do is hit it. He's gonna Dynamax that Drill Weed on. This is, I'm fine with this. I think I got it. I think I got it. Show me. He's scarfed, right? He, but he's not going to be able to one-shot my T-Tar with his Vanillux, right? That's the idea. He's not going to be able to one-shot me. If you didn't hit that Hypnosis on me, I'm pretty sure I would have got it. But let's see. There's the big Dynamax Rock Slide. There we go. Get out of here, Vanillux. Yo. You know what? Single target. SINGLE TARGET! I didn't got a light screen up cheap, but look at that damage! You have a light screen up and I'm still doing that much damage? Yo. You may have hit the T-Tar too, but you- That is the incorrect choice! This Rotom is sick. This Rotom is amazing. Rotom has that damage. And then we win! All because of Rotom. Uh, he's probably gonna max guard this turn. Uh, you let my uh, sash tick out, and I think that's fine because we're still gonna win. You know what? Nah, I still should Dynamax it. I want to Dynamax the Rotom. I am gonna Dynamax my Rotom. I don't give a shit. I want to see what it looks like. That's why. I know I'm losing my uh, specs, but I just want to see what it looks like, Dynamax. He should be max guarding though. Oh, he just scoops. Dang it! Oh, come on. Let me, let me look at what my big Dynamax boy would look like. Yeah, that team's gonna be hard to beat. But Tdr Exit will have what it takes. Plus one for Colossal. I don't have one. I don't have any poke. I don't have like any Pokemon, guys. All right, let's go. Fluffy. Yeah, this team's gonna be a hard matchup. Like Lucario Wim is hard. Charizard's hard. Like Charizard, like Lax is hard to deal with. Definitely gonna be an uphill battle. Good thing is he doesn't have any Intimidators, but also bad because I wanted to use like Phalanx, you know? Charizard Tokus. Oh, the rocks? The, the rocks? Oh, this, this is rock solid lead for me. Like, what? What made you think that you could lead Charizard Togekiss into this? I mean, I still haven't like won, but like, oh my gosh. Rocks? On rocks? On rocks, on rocks, on rocks. I want you to update your my trainer. Oh, I should. He's gonna Dynamax, but like I don't even know, Chief. Uh, it'd be hard to deal with Char or Togekiss Dynamax. I hope it's Charles that's Dynamaxing. That's good for me. That's good for business, right there. Yo, my guy. If if I hit these rock slides, you're in for a bad time. And by the way, he's not even wrong. He's probably gonna be going follow me this turn and going for like a big attack, right? Are you following? Me? Yeah. So this should still be really good. And the reason this is good for me is because I'm using Choice Scarf T Tar, right? I got the Choice Scarf. Right now he's like, Psh, I can eat an extra Rock Slide, no problem. But can you eat a Choice Scarf T-Tar Rock Slide? Survey says, get the hell out of here. Get out of town. Choice Scarf. I got the crit. You don't even need it, Chief. That out of here. Choice Scarf T-Tar. Golden Oldie VGC 2015, baby. Spec. Busted. You love to see it. Nah, nah, wh where's your Dynamax? Where'd it go? What happened to that Dynamax you were rocking earlier? It'd be a shame if we just dumpstered you. DC incoming? He's he might run. Yeah, battle's canceled. Yo! Titar Excadrill! Gr he's gonna go Grimmsnarl, I think. 
And so I'm gonna really try and push an advantage by going with like, I think Falling's and baiting the fake outs and then like winning with other stuff. So if I go like, if I go like Grimmsnarl Butterfree, I think he can only fake out one. And also I have the ability to fake out two. So I think it's actually really good. And then I think we have to go Titar Harvester on the back and just hope that he doesn't get like a trick him up. Yeah, it's my best shot. I think Titar Harvester is still really good here. Um, if we can not die, right? That's the idea. Here we go. We have the potential to win this one. This guy has super high rank too, and he's super serious about how long he's taking in this team preview. Drinking the tears of those dumpstered by this team. Yo, people are definitely getting dumpstered by this team. That's about right. Every game this team, every game this team wins is a solid win. All right, so let's let's get let's keep climbing with those wins. Let's keep it climbing. Who do you think they're gonna lead with? Are you gonna Vanillax me? Vanillax would be not a great lead. I think it's gonna be like Grim Snarl and like a tech choice. Yeah. Oh, Gothitelle. Okay. So we have fake outs, but I have fake out. Right. You made this. I made this. Can't fake out the Chandelure either. I could Dynamax, but if he Dynamaxes against me, that's really bad. So I think I'm actually just gonna hard switch in my T-Tar. And I'm going to fake out the Gothitelle. And then he's going to Heat Wave. It's going to hit T-Tar. Yeah, it's going to hit Grimstown, force it out, and then we're going to bring an Exodrill, and then we're in a good spot. Yeah, it seems about right. So we're going to be taking a little bit of chip damage. Uh, we might be able to get burned in our T-Tar. That would suck. You build me a Colossal team if I dropped a Gold Tier Patreon sub. Uh, you don't have to do that. Um, I can just build a Colossal team probably. I would never force, I would never like gate content like that if people just wanted help. There's the heat wave, it's gonna proc the Grimstone eject button, I think it's totally fine. Hopefully it doesn't burn any of us, right? 10%? Yeah, awesome. So it sucks we're getting eject buttoned out, but I still think it's fine. I still think it's fine. Uh, we're able to bring in, I mean, I could actually bring the Butterfree in here, couldn't I? Because Titar outspeeds the Chandelure, yeah, that's, this, is, this is way better. Way better! Any plans for singles? Maybe. No plans for singles today. The last Patreon team I made was a singles team, though. All right, so we're going to be able to crunch that right in the face. I don't think Rockslide would KO. I think I'm just going to go in for the crunch. And I'm just going to go in for the Slink Powder over there. I kind of wish I was locking myself in the rock slide, but, like, I don't know. Great time watching your Pokemon stuff. Found YouTube a month back. I don't really play Pokemon, but I really enjoy watching the content. That's awesome. Glad to hear it. Shandor goes down because Choice Scarf Tyranitar is the best Pokemon in the world. And uh, Gothitelle gets Sleep Powder. I was going to be like, I was feeling that Sleep Powder miss. It can miss, even with Compound Eyes. It's like a 2% chance. So Gothitelle, take a nice little nap. I can crunch that next turn. I can go for the... Uh, what is it? I can go for like a befuddle. I can go for an airstream. I can go for a sleep powder or whatever he sends out. It's going to force him to send out something fast. And let's see if it's something that can check both T-Tar and Butterfree. Those poke There's not usually things that check both of them. I can't really check both of them. I can check one of them. I can't really switch into anything either. Oh, I can switch into Gripstone. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Worst case scenario, uh, he attacks the Butterfree here. Grimstone gets a free switch in, and uh, we can fake out the Passamon. All right, I was wondering how much a stat is affected by the host pointer plus two. Uh, if I got 100 speed and Electro hit me, um, how much 100 speed would I have? So, oh, what did he use? Sorry, I didn't see what he used. Did I outspeed that thing? This board is terrible. <laughs> like, my, feet, my board is not great. Let's see what I should actually be doing here. Um... So, a plus one is a 50% boost, and a plus two is a double, right? That's the best way to describe it. Let's see what I actually should be doing here. Should I be reflecting here? I think I'm actually going to spirit break that, and I actually am going to befuddle the shit out of this guy right now. If he sets Trick Room, I lose. Actually, the best play is to do it like this, then. The best way is to spirit break into the Gothitelle and have it be redirected. Because I think Pollen Puff is enough. Pollen Puff. This should just KO. Yep, and then the Spirit Brick's gonna get redirected. But if it didn't, you know, I didn't want to set Trick Room. 
So spirit break. He wasn't expecting that spirit break. They never do. They never expect it. Okay, that, that's a really bulky boy. Holy moly, I didn't think that would be that bulky. That sucks. I didn't think that, that. I thought that would just KO. So that's my fault. No, oh, one turn sleep. Are you for real? And a rock slide? That sucks. That's so lame. That's so lame. I, th I didn't think that that would. Uh... That's just my fault, I guess. My fault. It must be, is it vested, you think? Because it's super bulky. I was going to send extra draw out. kind of want to send the T-Tar out, but I'm going to send the extra draw out. Yeah, Butterfree going on there is huge. Rotom against my extra drill? Oh, never lucky. All right. Um, I think this is fine, though. Um, we're going to be able to just spirit break the Rotom just to start softening it up. I think I'm going to Iron Head. I haven't even Dynamaxed yet, have I? I'm going to save my T-Tar to Dynamax with. I don't think that Passamon can protect. I think it's vested and bulky. So again, I'm going to do the exact same play. Go, but underneath the Passamon, and this should get redirected. I don't think it can protect. Yeah. So this might not KO. The reason why I did this is because, like, we haven't seen him Dynamax yet, right? And so if he were to Dynamax there, he would have lived the Iron Head. And he's going to go for a Hydro. Oh, that can miss, Chief. You know, the Grim Snarl. Ooh, wise choice. That's not, you're not even wrong. That's a pretty good choice. Sandstorm subsides just in time for my boy. Just in time for my boy! Alright, Tyranitar. Show us what you're working with. Okay, let's see. How should I deal with this? Who do I want to Dynamax with? That's actually a really good question. Because, like, T-Tar could attack right now. And then Extra could have, like, three turns. I think I'm going to Dynamax with the T-Tar. I'm faster than this Rotom, probably. Ooh, should I actually be using a... Crunch lowers what? Do we go over to special... Oh, a special D? Yeah, it's actually better to use max Rock Ball. Because in case he, like, Dynamaxes and uses the max, uh... Hydro Pump thing. Yeah. It's better to use the max Rock Ball to always have Sand Up. Dream Game. Take a shot every time. He says, never lucky. Hate to see it. And that can miss. Oh, uh, you would die. You would actually just die. Big T-Tar. I never Dynamax the T-Tar. Except for when I do Dynamax the T-Tar. He's going Dynamax as well? Alright. Okay. Sleep Powder. The Dynamax moves are reasonable supports. Palm Puff can heal an ally, and then you could have tail or Tailwind. Yep. Yeah, each plus one is additional 50%. Alright, I'm gonna see how much damage this does. He actually might be able to outspeed me since I'm losing my scarf, but we'll see. I mean, he's not outspeeding this rock slide. It's not nearly enough damage. Rock ball. Alright. I wanna see how much damage, like, the water attack does. Like, if he crits my T-Tar with a water attack with a max geyser, that would, be, that would suck. Don't do it. Don't you do it. Don't you dare crit my T-Tar! You know, that's right. Even if, actually, we would've lived a crit. We would've lived a crit about, like, 10%. And he sets the rain. I'm gonna reset that. I wonder if he's gonna go for like max guard plays. I still think we can do this. If you max guards, that's like how you lose. So rock slide. Oh, that sucks! If I just miss every single rock slide from here to forever. Yeah, that rock slide would have been able to finish it off. That's lame. Don't make me iron head, you chief. I'm about to iron head this guy. TR outspeed Rotom? Yeah, well, we're normally Scarf, so we have investment in speed. TR is down. And now there's no more sand. <sighs> Alright. We just gotta hit a rock slide, guys. Put a couple rocks up in chat for me. You guys could help me out. Put a couple rocks up. Just a couple little baby rocks. And let's rock slide and roll. One rocks. No, you're you gotta put the rocks up. See, it's a too late. No, what is this game? I've missed two rock slides in a row. I've missed two rock slides in a row. Literally zero lucky. I need more rocks. I need more. Do you guys think Iron Head kills? It's fourth, guys. 
Do you, what's the play? Would you guys iron head here? I'm going to iron head it. It's, he's in my head. It's fourth, guys. I should just rock slide. You guys put the rocks up. I'll reply back with the rocks. There we go. Reply rewarded. Rock slide succeeds. We take those. We take them. I had it the whole time, right? I had it the whole time. 